Good morning, everyone, and happy Friday to you. I hope that you've enjoyed this week's uh, series on how to improve your LinkedIn profile. So before I do a summary of the tips that I shared this week, I wanted to share something funny with you. I, uh, I've had a few people um, send me messages to go, Jennifer, does your hair actually get higher as the week progresses? And anyway, I thought that was very funny and uh, you probably will too. So who knows what my hair is gonna look like next week. Anyway, um, let's get started with the summary. So what I talked about this week is um, a current professional photo on your LinkedIn profile is critical, it should be flattering, it should never be in party mode, so just give some thought to your um, profile photo. The next thing is have a strong headliner, use good descriptors to uh, describe your um, special talents and skills, and uh, your summary is very important. Remember to write your summary in the first person. You want to be authentic, engaging, and you, uh, you want your summary to let people know uh, a little bit about who you are on, on the personal side as well. So your work experience should be current and relevant. And remember, never copy and paste your resume to show your work experience. And lastly, endorsements, recommendations, and testimonials will give you your profile uh, a real boost. So I hope that uh, some or all of my tips were helpful to you uh, this week and if there is anything that I can help you with uh, regarding uh, my weekly series of things you'd like me to chat about, if it's etiquette, if it's uh, business leadership, I would be happy to do that. So you can just send me a message on LinkedIn. Now, I will wish you all a very happy weekend, and I'll look forward to chatting with you again next week. Take care. Bye-bye for now.